Hello everyone and a very warm welcome to today's tutorial in which we are going to merge documents using Power Automate. So before getting into the actual demo, let's look at a use case. So here in my SharePoint, I have got a folder and inside the folder, I have got few documents. I want to merge all of these documents once a day. I'll again repeat, I want to merge all these documents once a day and store the output in the OneDrive folder named as merged. So without wasting any further time, let's get into the demo. So first and foremost, I will create a Power Automate and I want to run it once a day. I'll use a scheduled flow. So I want to run it once a day. So I will use a scheduled flow. I'll give my flow a name and I'll click create. Now that I have my trigger configured, I can also configure the advanced properties. Let's say that I want to run it around 19 hours every day. And I can also select the time zone. The time zone that I'm going to select is IST. Perfect. So my flow runs once a day during the IST time zone and it will run at 19 hours. Next, I want to get the files from my SharePoint. So I'll type in SharePoint and I'll use get files action. So get files properties only. To this particular action, I will provide the site address, the library where the documents are stored. So the name of the library is merge demo, merge demo. And then I will limit it to a particular folder. So again, merge demo and then limit it to this folder. So what it will do, it will go and get all the documents from this particular folder. Next, I will need to initialize a variable. The initialization of variable is very important because this will hold our file array, which we will pass to the merge action. So I'll just rename it, initialize variable file array, and I'll give it a name file ARR file array and I'll set it to a type array. Next, I want to get the file content so that I can merge them together. So I'll type in SharePoint and I'll type get file content. Here I'll pass it the site collection URL and I'll pass it the identifier. The identifier is the output of the get files action. And if you see my friends, it has automatically decorated the get file content with an apply to each loop because the output of the get file action is an array. Next, I want to create the array for the merge. So I will type in append array to variable. So each and every time it goes and loops, it should create and it should append an item to an array. That is the file to an array. So first I need to pass it the source file name and it's going to be the output of the get files action. So file name with extension. Next, I need to pass it the source file content, which is the output of the get file content action above. Now that we have created the array and appended each and every file to an array, next, I'm going to merge them together. To merge the documents, I'm going to use the Mohembi connector and the action would be merge. So merge documents. So merge documents has got various options out here. However, the option that we are interested in is the small icon that you see on your screen where I'm pointing my mouse. If I click on this icon, it automatically changes the input to an array. And here I'm going to pass in the file array. Finally, I'm going to create my file in OneDrive. So I'll type in OneDrive for business and I'll use the create file action. Here, I'm going to select the path of where I want to store the document. So in the merged folder, I'll give it a name. So I'll hard code it. So merged. However, I'm going to pass it an expression that is UTC now, which will tell me when the file was merged. So dot pdf and finally i will pass in the processed file content and i think that's pretty much it 
I'll save my flow and we'll test our flow. Save and test. So here, if you see, it has picked up four files. So we have four files, so that is correct. It has created the array and it has passed the array to the merge document action out here. And finally, it has created the file in the merged folder. So let me refresh it. And if you see, it has created the file with the timestamp on it. I'll click on the file and let's quickly look at the output. So here, my friends, you see, first there is the PowerPoint slide. Then there is the Word document. Then there is the Excel document. And then you have the PDF being merged. Isn't this awesome? So within 10 minutes, you have merged documents using the Mohimbi PDF connector. I hope this demo was informative. Thank you for your time and bye-bye.